Hello guys, so today I will be showing you how to install Chrome WebDriver in your computer's path. And you might be thinking why should I install the Chrome drivers in my computer's path at first place. The reason behind um, that thing is you don't have to manually type in the location for the web driver again and again. And you just have to type a single statement. You can see over here driver equal to webdriver.chrome. You can just type the statement to initiate the driver. And I'm going to show you that it is not actually installed in my computer's path. Over here you can see Chrome driver executable needs to be in path. Now there are two different ways of installing Chrome driver in the computer's path. And today we will be following the easier way. First of all you have to download the driver from the Chrome's official website. And you can check the description for the links. And here's the web. Here's the website that I was talking about, chrome, chromedriver.chromium.org. And once you are here, you have to click on one of these links. First of all, you have to make sure the, that the Chrome version is matching with your default Chrome version. For that, you have to go to chrome colon and slash slash version. Again, you can find this thing in the description. You can just copy and paste it in the URL tab. And then once you're here, you have to um, see, you have to navigate at the top of this page. You could see there are a lot of different things over here. And you can see Google Chrome and the whole version is written over here. So in my case, I, I have 83.0.4103. So we have to make sure that these uh, the driver is also of the same version now I have to download this thing you might be thinking that uh, the last uh, digits don't match perfectly well it, it it doesn't actually really matter it, as long as the first three digits in my case 83.0.4103 is uh, matching so I have to download this driver Okay, so I clicked on that link and here I am having four different options. I have to click on Chrome driver underscore Windows 32 dot zip and uh, again, a new question would arise over here that I have Windows 64 and why should I in install something from Windows 32 well it's going to run anyway you have to just uh, install it and it's going to run it so we are going to extract the files to a folder and then so here we are having a single application so what you need to do you're just going to copy this thing and then paste it inside this location local disk C windows and then paste it over here so and now you have to click on continue there you go now yep that's it you don't have to do anything else you don't have to go and edit different things and you don't have to edit the path of your computer you don't have to add add any statements into the path now I'm going to show you that it is actually installed I'm gonna run this module and as you can see Chrome driver.exe is actually opening and I have not passed any get request so it is not going to open any website so I'm just gonna minimize this thing so yeah that's it for now guys um, hope you guys liked my video see you guys again